Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my Fallout 76 Atom Shop Today video. So let's start wasting time and jump right into the Atom Shop. Now I managed to mute my uh, audio. That's good. So let's take a look on what we got on the menu today, shall we? And ooh, American Patriot. I've seen this power armor before. I don't remember when. I think it was like January. I think it was here before, right? Comment down below if you know for sure that this paint uh, was provided to us before. Because I'm pretty sure I saw this one, and it sure does look cool. That's true. <laughs> yeah, the X01 man. That that is just insane. Cool. Well, I'm not a super power armor user, so I'm not gonna get it. This thing, I don't know. Five hundred. The original price for this was five hundred. Man, I would never believe that. That's true. What? No oh, way. Jesus Christ, I didn't even know that these things cost so much. I got all of mine from Bundle. It was just a lot of them, so I got it. But that that is insane. 500 for... Just for this? Oh my god. 40% discount. Yeah. Right. Uh... <laughs> no thank you? <laughs> But the paint, the paint is cool. I would get it actually, but as I said, I'm, I don't mainly use power armors. Maybe with my, ah, no, I don't think so. No, no, scrap that. Don't mind what I just. I, I'm planning to get a second character, <laughs> uh, and hopefully, maybe if I'll be able to stream it today. Out. <laughs> so yeah, nothing else pretty much changed. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I have nothing to display today since I'm not buying anything. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. Alright. Well, I really hope Bethesda will actually lower the prices on the Atom Shop like they did with uh, uh, the Patriot um, paint for the combat armor. Uh, the one we had yesterday. Where, by the way, they shown that it cost 600 then they gave us a discount and went with th 300 something. I don't remember already. You see, it's just I'm I'm always in action and uh, man, I don't even know when I get time to do these videos. <laughs> anyway, so my point is that turns out I forgot it was actually available to us before. It was available in January. I found uh, I found it online, and guess what? The starting price for that was 900 and not 600 and then plus they give us discount so I believe that Bethesda will lower the prices to the skins as long as we don't buy them on the full price <laughs> that's my theory because essentially they want to sell it and what rings to me here I was talking about this one Patriot Paint right so what t tells me is that when this thing popped and it cost 900 maybe nobody bought it or there were a very few sales so that's why supposedly in I don't think that uh, 4th of July by the way happy 4th of July <laughs> uh, had an effect on the price change I think that the discount was but not the overall price like you see this cost 600 uh, right but as I said when I looked it up on uh, Google Right. If you actually look it up, there's a video, by the way, another YouTuber is doing it. It's like around 50 seconds long, but he doesn't do any commentary on those. I didn't even know. I thought I was the only one doing the Adam Shop videos. <laughs> I guess I'm not the only one. So yeah, uh, and uh, the thing is, when I watched this video, this skin that I'm showing right now, the one that I owned, the Patriot one, 
the starting price was 900 <laughs> so yeah let's hope that other prices will drop as well and for my before you buy series that I'm gonna start as soon as I can I think I'm gonna start with a daredevil to warn everybody not to get it because I actually don't feel that was the best purchase I made <laughs> I don't remember how much items that I spent a uh, thousand two hundred and it's definitely 100% like not worth it this one right here this is what I'm talking about daredevil bodysuit this is probably the first outfit that I'm gonna cover in my do not uh, like before you buy video I need to speed it up I hope I'll be able to do it today after the live stream because uh, I'm gonna be leveling up a female character and I thought it was a good idea to show before you buy outfits I mean the outfits outfits right uh, on the male character and on the female character so I think that's a brilliant idea and sort of will help me to I don't know I don't wanna have I'm not gonna have her as a mule because I mean, I just don't have time to drop everything there, then take everything from the other character. If there was an ability to transfer like items from one character to another character, as long as it's in, within one account, that would be cool. But we don't have that option. Maybe many MMORPG games have that option, like the banks, right? In-game banks. You deposit stuff with your one character, then you can log out, log in with another one, and claim the stuff. So. If something Bethesda would supposedly create a Nuka Cola bank, <laughs> just thoughts out, out, out of my mind. That would be cool. And it would really solve a lot of problems. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyway, uh, this is where we're going to call it the end for this current episode. So, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, you know, drill. Hey, hold on a second. My base is being under attack, right? There was some sort of an explosion just now. I oh, know they're all dead. <laughs> so yeah, as I uh, hockey, 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 as I said, you know, drill. Don't forget to leave that like and say hello to that senorita right there. I don't know who she is. <laughs> uh, probably a customer. And uh, don't forget to leave your comments down below because I always make sure to get back to your comments. Just please don't use any full language because they put their place on hold and I do not approve those. Uh, also, YouTube has been uh, acting very weird and some of your comments go into spam section, which I have no idea why. And there's only one user, boy, <laughs> who is, uh, oh, any comment he makes, it goes into spam. I'm like, oh my god. So, no. I have to say, now, now I'm like not only checking my comments right all the time, plus the notification systems are wrong with it, so I have to like read through entire threads and stuff. So if I miss your comment, I do apologize. Uh, if your comment contained full language, I did read it, but I, I deleted it. And uh, the spam ones, I approve them as long as they're good. I mean, I had some dude. Uh, bombarding me with uh, freaking um, websites that like sell items and caps for real cash insta block insta ban insta everything followed and I've uh, took all the names of those companies because there was not just one company it was a few of them and I put it on blacklist so now even though if they pop they instantly go into block so I had to deal with that I mean, they offered me sponsorship, I declined it, like I don't know how many times I should decline it again, because I don't support that business, that business is real pay to win, right, like, I checked their website out, they were like selling like freaking laser guns with explosives and other stupid stuff, I mean, cool stuff, <laughs> but for money, real money, and that's not cool, I mean, that's not cool, I don't support it, because you, you never know how they got that item. Maybe a, a player just sold it to them, as they claim. But it could be pos uh, possible that they got that thing from hacked accounts, from duplication, from other stuff. And and overall, overall, I just don't support that sort of uh, stuff. I I saw like I've been watching a couple of videos for Fallout 76 as well on YouTube. Notice that some YouTubers actually took their offer. I'm like thinking, dude, come on, 
you're playing a game and you're promoting pay to win and then you're making videos that oh repair kids pay to win another thing huh pay to win and you're promoting pay to win product anyway i'm not going to name any youtubers none of that stuff i don't want to go you know drama stuff <laughs> just kind of like my thoughts and everything so yeah if you notice by the way any of such comments uh please do rep like report me if you still see it up I usually uh, react real fast because my phone always with me and all of your comments are always with me as well <laughs> and any comments that's why I, I end up uh, replying quickly I mean I reply when I'm on the way to work when I come back from work sometimes when I take a, a coffee break and stuff so I always got you covered <laughs> alright folks I've been talking so much we need to end this video so thanks for watching don't forget to leave your comment don't leave full language. And I'll see you on the next video. You have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys like it at. And by the way, if you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. And if you want to help my channel grow, please do consider sharing this video somewhere in the media, such as Facebook or Twitter, or maybe even save it to uh, your fa uh, to your YouTube playlist. And by the way, I noticed that someone I d I didn't have the time to find out who that was. He created a playlist uh, uploads by gamers that he saw. Who you are, thank you. I saw a huge list of my videos in that playlist. Uh, yeah, the analytics allows us YouTubers to see what is going on and where what's. Oh, it's a really big topic. Trust me, I did so much research on that thing. My brains, I don't know how they did not blow up and fly out on the moon. <laughs> and once again, if you're from the United States, happy 4th of July. I'll see you later. Bye. Like, <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, I thought I saw everything. Ha ha ha!